Hello and welcome to this video. I'm playing Drahachik here in the five minute pool. Isn't that boring? Yeah? Another way we have got, we've, we've had many yeah, in the in the world championship match. Okay, my opponent is playing the sideline here, which is arguably, arguably not brilliant, but I've, I've, I tend to always forget to look it up. Uh, and uh, I really should look it up. Mm, okay, my castle seems right. Uh, how does that work? Yeah, I cannot go d6 as c6 is. Knight c6 is the problem. So probably do this. Hmm. Yeah. Yeah, this is an occasionally played line and I tend to always forget to check it because when it actually happens I'm sitting there and think okay you know <laughs> why don't I don't I look it up once and then be okay I mean here I might have equality I might but it doesn't feel particularly great, to be honest. So what to do? 97 blunders the bishop, so not this one. The queen is extremely annoying. I wonder if I can somehow chase it away, but I don't quite see how this is going to be possible. I mean, white also doesn't have many options. He can maybe double, <clears throat> double on the e-file, but it doesn't feel very very attractive either hmm. i wonder if rook b8 rook b6 is actually an idea or rook b8 b3 hmm, yeah. ultimately doesn't lead to much hmm. i don't like my position yet it's, it's just not it's just not as it's just not equal he can double on the e file now. He doesn't. So I was a bit more worried about that. Mm. Mm, bit of a. It's it's annoying. Okay, my idea is to play queen d seven. It's not attractive at all. And I know that I still I'm still forgetting after that game to check on check this line. I actually don't expect him to trade, but you can enter the pre-move. Okay. Yeah, this I felt should be just completely dead. I mean, it's a little bit sad Check. that I have to play in that fashion, but it, it, is, it is what it is. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, it feels difficult eh, to do anything here with black. I actually have the slightly worse pawn structure, so knight f6, knight b4 might might be coming. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, it's not it's not the end of the world. Maybe he just trades anyway. Yeah, that's an extremely boring game. I, I, I always forget to look at this line. Black actually can get a fairly comfortable position here, but not in this way. This isn't even all that, all that good. Um, yes, so any way to, to handle this? Knight c6 coming in. Yeah. Hmm. Really an annoying, annoying uh, play. Maybe this and knight e7. Hmm. I'm taking ages here also for this. Hmm. He might want to play a5, but I don't think this is this is all that 
problematic. <clears throat> okay. He takes e7, I don't know, it still doesn't lead to much, but he's got more time and it's still a little bit easier for him. I wonder if he's actually better here or if it's just equal, not quite sure. Mm -hmm. Don't like to play a5, pawn to a5. Maybe this here first and then c6 push him back without knight before happening. This is actually okay. Knight e3, c4 is what he can do. But this, it doesn't bother me all that much in terms of equal. Oh. Check. Mm, yeah, I'm, I'm fine here position wise. Clock is not that good. But I'm catching up a little bit, so this is good to see. Yeah, I had a pretty bad position out of this opening. I mean, maybe it wasn't objectively bad, it was just um, extremely unattractive to, uh, to, to play. Not sure about d3, if this is a good idea, but okay, it, it wasn't a good idea, probably. But uh, we don't know yet. Time Until warning. Come up here, but so I can I can still cover this. Mm, let's, okay, rook f2 actually is an idea here. Ah, yes, got king c4. Shoot, I forgot about that. Okay, rook c2. Hmm, actually funny here. It's not so easy now for him to make a move. What is he playing? a5. Hmm, hmm don't have much time. Unfortunately, I would like to figure this out. Check. Well, this is easy. Oh no, it's not easy. Takes, takes, king of four, king of three, king g three. Hmm. I overlooked that move. That's unfortunate, really. Mm. And he's stopping me on the third rank. What? Check. That's, that's bad. Oh. Why did he allow me to advance all that far? Okay, maybe his pawns are quicker anyway. Yeah, his pawns are quicker. I can just take f2. How stupid. Yeah, I totally, totally uh, misplayed this ending. Of course, a little bit also due to the time, but still. You know. Black resigns. Mm, I actually think I was getting somewhere here. Like this. It looks very awkward for him. So can I do something in this ending? Let's switch on. Hmm, so G5. I completely overlooked that, that capture. 
I totally did not see King takes d4. It's a stupid, very stupid move. I have to do this, of course. I mean, I should never lose this position, just objectively. So, yeah, we probably have a draw. I just overlook King d4, which is fairly basic. So, this is the, the draw. Probably the result that was in this position uh, all along. Yeah, rook e4 was possible here. Maybe I should have thought about this for a bit longer. I didn't really take time there because I was happy to catch up and play quick moves. Yeah, it's a bit awful. Yeah, it, this, this, this opening line is an annoyance somehow because it doesn't get played often and when it does, I, I, I always ignore, ignore it and, and forget to check, check. it. Yeah, here, this is probably critical. He has an extremely um, good setup at the moment Check. with his pieces. And, uh, okay, this, this seems to definitely lose, but probably it is lost. It is probably lost already. Yeah, that, that, damn, that damn D4 line, it's, it's mostly a tricky line. It's not particularly great, but I tend to, I tend to forget to check it. It's just what it is. The computer gives rook b8 here for rook b4, I guess. Mm -hmm. It's something like that. This is a line where black is fine, but I, I simply never looked at, look at it. And then I get the same problems like in, in every game. Yeah, here this is not equal. And I think, uh, I mean, he was mostly content with playing something quickly. I thought like doubling on the e5 would be a bit more testing. I mean here I'm slowly uh, equalizing the check. position. Check. But it, it took took time of course. Yeah this is a bit more testing but I, I think I'm reasonably okay with how I defended this. Oh knight g6 was actually winning now. Oh cool. A g5 looked weird anyway but okay I, I mean <sighs> You feel tempted to play quickly when you when you are down on time, and it is it is just equal anyway. So I didn't really look for an advantage. Maybe here I can play tougher. I mean, rook b4 is better for black threatening d5. Hmm, that's a nice one. Yeah, okay. That that leads Check. to the that leads to the ending actually. The same position. I have this move, which I did not uh, really consider during the game. He, I mean, I did briefly, but um, I, I didn't want to invest like again 30 seconds because Check. you need some time to figure this out. I wonder why there. So here, is that a win or is that a win? Place this. C4, no, it said should be a draw. The computer gives black an advantage, but this should be a draw. There's no way forward. It would be weird if black would win this, I think. Yeah, okay, that was um, not particularly great. Thanks for watching.